Hello everyone. So today I want to share with you three tips regarding visualization. Um, and I will take this bike uh, for example. First, let me look at this component, which is this part, which is the headset. Uh, so I will pick it on, on screen because my alt mode is set to components. I can hit I to isolate it. And now let's say that I want to work on it, but you see that if I'm using the left view, uh, I'm not aligned regarding a given axis. Um, I can try to change, but I cannot easily sorry, find an axis to, to work with. So how to deal with it? For this, you can, and this is a bit hidden, you can right click on the um, cube and you can ask for true views. True view. So doing this, you can uh, hover your mouse over the uh, screen and select a face you would like to be uh, parallel to the screen. So yeah, it is done. And now you could, you should be able to um, rotate or to, uh, you, sh you should be able to apply rotations. But with this come, let's say tip number two, which is at that moment, what you can do also is again, right click and either you can align your view cube to a given system or you can align to front screen. Doing so, this is my new front, and then I can work with my model on this specific part. How, uh, the way I want it, it will be always aligned with the cube now. Uh, so if you're dealing with parts with a specific orientation, uh, this is two nice tips to have in mind. Obviously, at any time, you can reset to global and uh, get back sorry, oh, to the full view and show again all your bike model, for instance. Now for tip number three, um, uh, let's say that I want to work on the, especially on the frame, I, I would, I don't want anymore to work on the, on the wheels, uh, not the accessories. So for this, uh, let me escape. Um, by the way, the true view is also accessible from uh, this location. Um, so for this, let me hide the components that are the parts that I'm not interested in. So here they are. I will hide this one. And I will hide the wheels, the front brake. I take as many 1D here as possible in a single shot. There's one hidden behind here. So here I will hide everything. Same at the bottom, but I will need more um, selection to do it. And you see that it can be a bit tedious. So let's see what tip can help us to save some time later on. And here I can hide everything and this is typically the, the base model I want to work with. At that moment, I can lock my view, which means that from now on, if I hide some part, H, and now if I say A for showing everything again, only the parts that were belonging to the lock status are shown again. And the wheels, the accessories won't show again before I unlock and here if I hit A again, I have everything back. So the status is not kept in mind. So um, keep, keep in mind to keep it locked as long as you need to work on a given subsystem and to unlock it when you're done. So these were the three tips that I wanted to share. Thanks for reviewing.